guys, this is my first YouTube video and we're going to be painting. I've got my green and what we're going to be painting is a Christmas tree. And it kind of makes me wonder, why do we hang up Christmas trees? Like, did a tree grow when Christmas was born? Well, Jesus. Anyways, so what we're going to do, we paint a straight line first. That is going to be the base. Then we sprout some diagonal lines. Sprout? And that was my sister. Anyways, um, then we're going to make it a, then we're going to paint more straight lines that go upwards. And then we paint another diagonal line and we are going to keep on doing that. But make sure you have a little bit of room on the top. So, um, why we need room on the top is because, um, what will happen to the star if we don't leave room on the top? <laughs> of course we need a star. So, it doesn't look very good because I didn't want to waste your time. So I kind of rushed, but you don't have to rush. So... Now that I've done the tree bit, I will get this, the wood on afterwards. I'm going to take some yellow. I almost dipped the yellow in the green. And what we're going to do is we're just going to put a little blob there and then a little blob like that. Then kind of paint it around. So, there. We've got that. The star, that looks surprisingly weird. Afterwards, we're going to have to wait for it to um, dry. So, now I'm gonna get a kind of reddish color because I don't have any brown. This is the color we have closest to brown. It's called Cool Red. If you can't really see, it says right there. And let's squirt it on our plate. It looks like a turd, like seriously. Look, kind of looks like a pink. At least we've got something on me. Some kids don't even have paint, so they can't do painting videos. And remember, this is my first YouTube video, so if I mess up, please don't judge me because this is my first YouTube video. So. Now what I'm going to be doing is get a block of this pink, which will be our tree stump. I'll go like that. Make sure it's straight enough. So you should have something like that afterwards. If you've been listening to me, of course, and not just painting your own tree. Okay, dot there. Dip that in my water. Soon I might have to change it, it's like peach. Blah, 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 blah. On the newspaper. Oh my god, I need to wash that more. And I am only seven years old. Most people mistake me for eight years old. So now that we've got that bar part, I almost said bar to guard. Anyways. Um, now that we've got that part done, um, what I am going to do is I'm go. I accidentally folded over. Anyways, I am going to now get this blue, and I'm going to paint a square down here, and another square down here, and then I'm going to draw a little red, red butt. The squares are going to be presents, and if you're watching my video and you're trying to make a card for someone, this would be perfect, like a Christmas card. On the light, it's on, but that doesn't matter. Scrub it on his face, and it's... um, now that you've done that, you're going to get your coolish red, cool red, and now what you're going to do. I'm going to paint the top of a love heart. 
on the side like that that will be Santa but because he's just leaving your house with a giant Christmas tree and I think yes what you ask why are there any Christmas decorations now so um by now it should have dried if but if you've added as much paint as you, I have you suggest try doing the dryish dry bits then we're going to paint little circles and yeah and then you'll have your Christmas tree done and then I'll tell you what to do Okay, I know that didn't take very long because I don't have much room left on my fabulous tree. Well, I like calling it fabulous, even though it's just a regular Christmas tree. And I bet you're wondering what this paper is for. This isn't going to be the only painting I'm drawing today in my first video.